Hey, how's it going, guys? Hope you're doing well. It's your Canadian brother from another mother, and it's another beautiful day for us to enjoy. So, right now, I'm not on site, I'm actually on a farm here today, and uh, I was introduced to this amazing man that um, is also into farming, um, poultry farming, spe specializing on uh, layers. And I'm just here at the farm and I'm so inspired so far and I'm like, man, we have to record this and actually share this information and, you know, so he's actually taking us on a tour so far and I'd like to, to him to introduce himself. Uh, good afternoon, everybody. My name is Johnson Ajao and this is Great Zill Farms. Great Zill Farms Limited has been on for the past 20 years and as he has said, we are you are purely into layers. Layers set of poultry. That's all we do here. It's amazing. We only produce eggs, table eggs. Thank you. And uh, so far, like I think they have over over seventy thousand capacity when they're actually running at max uh, uh, max rate. And uh, we're going through their penthouses here. And uh, all the all the streets. It's just to provide shade to the uh, uh, to the pen, Abi. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And this penthouse is how many capacities so far? After this one. This one is about eleven thousand. Eleven thousand. Wow. Anyone? They were very. Let's go back. The front and the bed. Yeah. So now, what's your uh, daily, uh, what's it called? Your daily production like? Yes, just as I told you, it used to be about 1,900 days. Wow, 1,900 days. In those days when we were operating at full capacity. Yeah. But we think right from the time of COVID up to this moment, we have scaled down. Seriously, it was less than that, a thousand feet. A thousand feet, wow, that's still huge. Because the economy, I don't have to do it, that's still huge. Most of our products, because of the financial situation in the country, people don't buy. So you just find an, an X, it's a perishable, great product. So if you produce within a week, you don't sell, you have to. You have to throw them away. Wow. That just it is happening. So we are scaling down to respond to the economic crisis that we have to get with right now. Oh, okay. That's just it. This particular thing is in the thousand. Ten thousand capacity. No. They're already connecting some eggs. Over fifteen thousand capacity. Fifteen, fifteen thousand. Yes. And I've told you the length. This one is about over three hundred feet. This one is about three hundred feet. See that they are best inside. So it's okay. You see that they are best inside. You can't. Can yeah. Food. You are best inside. Normally, when you have a capacity like that, the food will be close to around 450 feet per day. Mm. Yes, it will be. Food will be 300. I mean, 450. Normally, per day. And that's uh, that's at uh, maybe ninety over ninety percent. It's something, it's something. Yeah. Most of the time, we don't we might not even get up. We get up to ninety, but that's at the peak. So that is going to move down. Eighty to five to ninety, but we are just coming out of the stress now. So the production is still not very good. Still, you can okay. see that what I told you is eight eight times. System for food. There are two types, as I told you, there's the battery system and then there's the eight type. Yeah, you can stand over it mm. inside. There's the eight type. Not really. Yeah. 
And it's so, you know, so clean too. Yeah, yeah. That's amazing. Yeah, yeah. 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 So you have your own tractor too? Ah, so we have two tractors. Yeah. Two tractors? Ah, uh, we have. I told you, this is just for the clearing of the bushes. And for airlines, you can see that we have a, a cargo behind us. Yeah. For airlines, for clearing of the bushes, for school. You can see that we engage in it. So family, huh? it's not much. This is a uh, cassava. They are just planting maize. So this is what we use to you know, power our implements. This is what we use to power. And uh, you use the waste from the yes to mm. probably fertilize. Yes, to fertilize. Yeah. Because of uh, the issue of uh, uh, impurities and bacteria and all that inside water. So, at times we use some uh, chemicals. We have some chemicals in the industry that we use. Uh, the most important thing is to keep the water clean. There's another thing is that, for example, any chemical that has chlorine, you must be very, very careful when you use them. You understand? Yeah. Especially when you want to use vaccines, it must, the water must not be chlorinated or have any harmful chemicals in it. Okay. So you do, you do feed the water. This one has a capacity of 50,000. 10,000? 10, um, okay. So this is okay. I brewed him pen. Okay. Brewing. Then, then, then uh, what age do you transfer to the uh, to the cage? Ah, uh, we transfer right from the point of cage. Everything from thirteen, fourteen weeks. Okay. You can see that we are already transferring. You can see that. That's how it is. So, so, huge. so how many is in this place right now? Uh, we are transferring presently. Oh, okay, already transferring. Yeah, uh, we are transferring to uh, before we start transferring, I think about 8,000. 8,000? Mm. Wow. Okay. Because I'm also looking at, um, our, our first be starting with a capacity of 5,000. Okay. Then I'm looking at okay the five thousand we're we'll, we'll going to stock from uh, point of cage. Okay. Um, then I'm also looking. Yeah, go ahead. You, you need only one pen. Yeah. If yes. you guys, if you trust them, the only thing you need to be careful of the quality of the pens you are collecting. Because in in any any farming venture, you mind the seed, kind of seed. So even if you are going to collect this, you are very sure of where those people collect their pets, the quality of their pets. But not just as I told you, we do our own home pets for the batch. We know where we collected them from, we know what we are bringing them up to this point. So if anything goes wrong, we know how to handle it. Yeah. Because poetry is a very risky nature. You, know, you just need to be very careful if you want to collect a point of, point of cage. We call it a pop point of cage. Mm -hmm. But yeah. Then, yeah you don't sell a point of cage at all. Mm -hmm. Except maybe somebody has to help us collect them when you are collecting them. You know, this is so amazing. You just make position. So if I need a point of, point of cage, is that possible? You don't know it. It's fine, it's fine. You can with our own time table. Oh, okay. If, for example, you ask us now, uh, when are you collecting your base? And I told you that, okay, let us collect about 2,000 or 5,000. Then we add it to our own. Uh, that, that is possible. But it's not, there are some farms that do it. That's what they do. That's the collect, they, they only produce point of page. Yeah. But our own here, our major concern is to produce steps. 
the job of service to produce things. But I'm also looking at in the future, I want to actually start from day one, mm -hmm. point of then transfer into cage. It's okay, you just have to do it. Yeah. That's what we do here. You can see that we just transfer to some of the two lines. Oh, okay. Another point, John. We just use them for the things. Okay, so for parts. Uh, so oh. Because we can't import now. Because of the situation in the country, because of uh, forex, forex and all that. So that we see that I think we are doing that thing. That. Oh, good thing. This way we collected some parts. Mm -hmm. So these are the A-type um, battery. It's the A-type, not battery, it's the A-type. Sorry, the A-type um, cage. The A -type. All our things here are A-type. You can see, it looks like A. Yeah. <laughs> that's why it's A-type. It's the same. Oh, that's all right. mm -hmm. This one is easier in the tropics. It's meant for this kind of environment. The, you can see the space between between the yeah, a lot of space, space, space between one line to the other, then between one side, so it's for creation. For here yeah. not to build up, so that's why it's there. You know, we are just coming out of this race now. If not for this type of thing, you have lost this massive because of it. It helps to maintain good effort. Uh, and then another thing is that we only use cable to power to scrape. Yeah. As you saw the cable. And even to feed is the cable. You can see that that particular yeah. cable there. That's what transpires. So all those automated uh, feeding as well. Yeah, of course. That's wow. this bucket that you are seeing. Yeah. Uh, it's what they use. It's there, it's there. This one is on the back. Oh, okay. Uh, when they want to so feed. that's it now, they, yes. they feed them. Okay. <laughs> when, they, when they want to feed, they move it. That, that's what feeds. But you want to also go and feed from the rest. Yes, if you don't mind. <laughs> that will require a lot of uh, power. Uh, I'd like to see your generator. Uh, Just your generator. Uh, what do you spend on uh, petrol every month? Ah, this is. Show the move. Eh? Move the Eh? I will say. Bar me move. Put that in. So you have your own silo your own uh, mail. Yes, yeah, we have a, uh, That's amazing. So you, you sell your own feed to uh, you only just mail it. You don't sell feed after two, I don't do such. Eh? I only engage in my poetry. I'm okay. not interested in feed and I'm only interested let, let's go. Ahead. I'm only interested in, in yeah, selling. You see his mail, it's huge. Yeah. I'm only interested so in this is the entire building of the mail. Yeah, yeah. And uh, yeah. this for storage. It's amazing. Yeah. So, uh, me that I'm starting 5,000 capacity, like, uh, what advice would you give me? You know, like, it's very important to me. I don't, I've done the training, but I don't just want to dive in. I just need guidance for sure. Like, I can't say, oh, yeah, I know it or stuff like that. So, that's why I'm here, like, to see what you have going and, you know, get advice from you. And through the whole process, too, I'll be letting you know the whole process. And, well, like, so what? Well, we also started from twenty years ago. Twenty years ago, wow! Because we were very, very optimistic and committed to the economy of the nation. 
you know, uh, poultry production is also a part of the manufacturing process in the country. Yeah. We need to produce what we So when I see younger person wants to retire, I encourage them. Because you cannot, the nation cannot afford to be people. So if you are enthusiastic, committed, hardworking, if the poultry venture is not good, we cannot get to the size. We cannot be there for 20 years. So the fact that people like us are still tells you that it's a very good area of business. You understand? Yeah. It's a very good area of business, irrespective of what the economy is saying now. So as soon as the economy begins to pick up, all the sectors will also begin to pick up. What is happening to us is not strange. And it's not peculiar to the poultry industry. It's, it's everywhere. But for you starting, you have a lot of courage. Even for you to think of poetry, it's a lot of courage. Oh, really? <laughs> it's a lot of courage. <laughs> yes, I'm, I'm still not leaving it. I'm there. So I know as, as soon as the economy picks up, we also, we also be happy. It's a very good business. Very, very good business. So yeah, check out his uh, mail. Huge, really, really massive. So basically, uh, you store a bunch of um, corn, soybeans, yes. raw materials in. This and that. And this one is soya. Soya. We source our soya from the north. Not that, no, all this one is there from the north. We have Utoba. Utoba comes from the flower manufacturing and flower producing company. So those are the major people. We have some other ones like uh, lime stone that we have yeah. We have salt, you can see salt. We have bone the other side of the way at the back. So those are the you have your mixer and the... Yes, this is the feed meal. We call, feed it, meal. We call it the feed meal. It's locally produced too. So oh, this one is locally produced? Yes, it's locally produced. And we have been running since 2013. 2013. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. So this one is a uh, finished produce? Yes, it's supposed to move to the... Maybe this is one for this evening or tomorrow. So you feel like you're definitely saving a lot by producing your own feed yourself, honey? Uh, saving? You mean finance? Yeah. Uh, oh, you have control of the quality. Of the don't, don't put your mind in that area. That's what I keep telling you. Oh, really? Especially now that the ingredients are very, very expensive. What I was explaining to you the other time about the base is about the quality of the base you bring to your farm. The same thing, what we are after is about the quality of the feed. Not necessarily the financial aspect. But the cheapest may not be the best. You should do that. Yeah, 100%. So, those people that are selling feeds, the ask is to buy materials, produce the food, and sell to you. That's where their responsibility ends. So your own responsibility starts from where you buy the feed and what you are going to get out of the feed. And you know, in the protein industry, it's garbage in. garbage out. So if I buy a feed from you, I can't see what you have inside. If I open a bag of feed here now, you cannot possibly tell me, even if you are a witch, you cannot tell me everything that is there. So, but me that I've produced, I know what I've put inside. You understand? So, that's the most important thing. The quality of the feed you give to the pets is also very important. In poultry, we don't compromise in this place. It's not a matter of food. It's only after producing, we cost it. We know what we have inside. 
So the other time you were talking of 90%. You cannot just put in any garbage to the best and expect 90%. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't work like that. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. The tractor that put the car. But that sucks the waste. Yeah, that sucks. Oh, okay. This one has been there now. We told this one. That was seven. That was seven. We bought this one in Pagan Twins. Everything's good. Normally now, so it's power, it's not generated. Uh, it's good to be slow. There's no longer slow now. We have to improvise. You can't. There's no way we can do that anymore now. So we... Just like I was showing you the The bigger chain, we operate them when we are operating the fit me. Because of the questions. And as soon as they finish, we defeat me. Go to the uh, smaller gens that will give us power till maybe 12 o'clock in the night. You understand? Yeah. In the night, we have the chair. We now have good solar light and lighting. Yeah. And that's it. You didn't mention it when we were in the farm. You have seen the couple. Yeah, I saw some. Yeah. Yeah. So, this one we choose. Before it used to be 24 hours, but now we can't have it. Yeah, let's see your, your, your death. I can't imagine how much I was spending on, uh, on this one. <laughs> I can't spend it on this one. Thank you. Four million. Four million. Four million. Now was a You'll be asking me why do we have so many kids? Yeah, we so many kids. <laughs> In this place, we, we not only use the gen for those machines that you see, we use them to pump water too. Here is not Nepal. You cannot afford to fail for any minute here. This must have to work perfectly. You can see the number of things. If there's a water failure, how many tons of water do you think I'll bring into the bank? And how, how do I do it? So water must not fail. Power must not fail. Power fail. There's no fit. You are asking me why water to buy materials like this? Because what you must do is not perfect. You don't have room for people. Or the, the crisis will be massive. Or the crisis will be massive. You don't have Always. 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 Always.
But you can see that it's made. Look over. Look over. Get it. Okay. Mm. And even inside of them. Wow. It's amazing. Mm. Let me show you. Hey guys, so we're back on site and uh, yeah. So I hope you got some information from the video and uh, I found it very uh, inspiring and I actually enjoyed the the uh, tour at the farm and uh, hopefully one day you know we're at that level or past that level by the power of God. So yeah, and, um, yeah, I was able to get a lot of information from the man and um, it was really inspiring for me. And um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.